Hello my YouTube fans, welcome to episode 21 of Clarence and His House, Adventures of a Lifetime. I am your host, the six-time handball champion, the Staten Island ICU of New York, Clarence Pryor. Well, recently, this is going to be a very special emotional episode, and I want to talk to my YouTube fans about something that they might want to hear from me. So, this may be very hard for them to understand, so this is going to be a very special episode, uh, what I'm going to reveal. And I thought you guys might want to hear from me. So, either way, here we go. Remember, uh, la um, last year I made a YouTube video on how I was bullied. Yeah, because recently, um, lots of people have been bullied before, including me. Because, say, like, they bully because out there straight, they're gay, or they're lesbian, because, or they're different because of that. I mean, and all of a sudden, I felt sorry for the people that have been bullied because all of a sudden they committed suicide. And I felt really upset. I felt sorry for them, and I hope their families would, uh, I know they missed their, well, their loved uh, uh, son or daughter who ever been bullied before so much. I know it's been really hard, so so I want to talk to you guys about something important. So this is this will be a very special episode that I want to talk to my YouTube fans about, and I hope they'll they won't hate me, and I hope they understand why I've been going through. So either way, I want to make sure to talk about this right now. Well, ever since I made a, a YouTube video on how I was bullied. And um, and I thought I talked to my friend Ronnie Kroll from a friend movement that I'm part the anti-bullying program that I was part of, and I want to thank Ronnie Kroll for that for having me be part of uh, the friend movement because the only F word is friend, not those other F words that insults you like that. Say like someone call you fat, someone call you uh, the other word that I don't want to pronounce, or some or the other F word that. Uh, call you somebody call you a freak uh, either way the only F word for the friend movie we're looking for is friend so recently ever since my mom and her friend made this rainbow bracelet for me to show pride or for the LGBT community and I'm support them 100% so either way this is why guys this is what you, my YouTube fans, I want to talk to you about something important. So either way, here it is. Ever since, uh, I've been having a very emotional day last week of what I've been going through. I thought I'd talk to my, like, our friends, talk to my our friends back at South Beach. And uh, most importantly, I want to talk to my mom about this. And I want to make sure to be honest with you YouTube fans. And you guys been having me much more welcome to YouTube world. And I want to thank you, my YouTube fans, for everything. For, you know, from the bottom of my heart. So, here it is. Recently, I talked with my mom last week. And I want to make sure to share my story with you guys. So, what I'm about to reveal, I know it may shock all of you. Uh... Some may shock, some they'll be really, they won't understand, some that will understand. So everyone, I want to let everyone know that I'm gay. And it doesn't bother me one bit. And my mom, uh, I'll be honest with my mom, I talk to her about it, and it means much. And she supports me. Uh, I have gay friends too. I have two, uh, at least three. Um, their names are Chase and Sean and um, and my longtime friend Joe uh, Joe Stalin um, he's been a really great friend I support him Drew I mean I don't know if I'm ever right for a relationship because you know it's really hard and I'll, I just want to thank my mom and my friends for supporting me coming out um, Colby Melvin's story of coming out really inspires me and I want to thank him for that so either way I want to say I'm gay and I'm proud of uh, being who I am. I'm still the same kindest person that I am. I'm still the, the the brave one right here. 
I'm still the bravest one because I will still be Clarence Alexander Pryor. I will still be who I am. But no matter what happens, we're all people here. And I would never judge them of who they are. No matter what happens. No matter if you're gay, no matter if you're straight, no matter if you're lesbian, or you're transgender. But either way, this is what's important. So no matter what happens, this is, this is what I revealed. So either way. That's it for this special episode of Clarence in His House. Don't forget to leave your comments on my YouTube channel. And like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. Also join the Friend Movement at friendmovement.com. Like their fan page on Facebook and follow them on Twitter. Including Ronnie Cole as well. Follow him on Twitter as well. So take care of my YouTube fans. Because every day I'm fist bumping. So until then, I'll see you next time for a new episode. Uh, the second episode will be coming up next. So I'll be back later. So until then, Stan I see is going to take a break for now. So for my YouTube fans, that's all I'm going to reveal. Thank you for having me be part of this uh, YouTube world. And no matter what happens, all of you fans are still great to me. God bless you. Goodbye, guys.